Well, howdy, tubers. Well, while I was at uh, the Hummel gathering there, a guy named Scott was interested in my trailer because he's going to go from uh, Michigan down here, down to Joplin, Missouri, which is, I don't know, 125, 150 miles from me. But he wanted to, to see how I did this trailer. So I thought I would do a video for him, and I already took some pictures to send to him. But I'll give you a few d dimensions here. Well, this, I guess it's a 2 by 10 then, is 8 foot long. And this 2 by 2 angle is uh, 6 foot long. And it extends, extends from the frame over to here. Let's see. Looks like 16 inches, and I I would assume both ways, yep. And so, of course, my ramps are, of course, I got two different sizes. One's a, a 2 by 10 and one's a 2 by 8 or something, so that's an option on there. But I, of course, got uh, wing nuts and, and a big washer there that's going into this board. This here is a uh, eye bolt. I don't know if it'll show up here or not. An eye bolt, and of course, that's what I attach the, the straps. Just go around from there and around your landing gear and back down to the other side and clamp her down and then uh, once you get it up on there then I take and push this and it'll go over that and then and kind of lock lock in which just happened to work like that it wasn't like I planned that but since this is not actually two by two that works out great so it just locks in there and then of course when you got it strapped down it holds that down too and then got a uh, another angle piece down here that's bolted down and I, I imagine these dimensions aren't that critical but we'll say okay 12 inch 2 by 2s 5 foot um, we'll say 2 by 8 2 by 10s now those brackets there that I just put on there I put them on there when I went when I took this down to Wichita to haul back the aluminum for the H5 and it bolted on right there because they brought it out on kind of a pallet thing now Scott kept asking me about this and this is only going to matter if you've got a tail wheel that's got spokes in it so that you can go through there and but then I was telling him about a, a u-shaped channel this is I think fence post or something or you can put a weld on a piece of angle, but just something to kind of capture the tail wheel. And then this one, well, it was this long, but the H5 is a foot longer, so I extended it. But this here was 14 feet. It's 14 feet from here to there. And then I, I added another piece on there and had another trailer hitch on there. And I, I to a family reunion nine years ago, I guess it was, eight or, eight or nine years ago, I pulled my three-wheeler behind there on a little Harbor Freight trailer. And the airplane. So, oh, and, uh, and then this is my rudder. Uh, hold down I guess got wing nut on one end this is three foot long by two uh, I guess it's, I guess it's probably half inch half inch or three eighths plywood but I guess you can probably make it what, out of whatever and then I glued foam inside there and that just keeps the rudder from flopping back and forth and like I told Scott on the phone I 
I put a bungee cord around. Of course, remember I just took this to that church block party on the uh, on the eleventh. But I put a a bungee loop hook around bulkhead B there, around that, and back to bulkhead B to hold the stick forward because you're traveling backwards. So, and like I told him, and like I guess he had seen that I got a, well, at that church thing, I just used my, my car because I wasn't taking the wings, but the wings will fit in the back of my Astro van. And I found out they'll fit in the back of the Astro van with or without the seats. Now, I ain't saying with the seats in there, it isn't a little tight, but it works. And then when you when you get somewhere and get the wings out, well, then you can still use the, the van. People don't have to sit on the floor because we've done that at the Hummel gathering before when I've taken the Ultra Cruiser up there. So I hope that helps out. Uh, Scott and and maybe many others if they just want a little simple trailer that they can haul their ultra cruiser or h5 on so there you go god bless